Hey, what's up, guys? Just wanted to redo my Kurt or Seed of Chucky rant video. Um, <clears throat> the the one I did originally, I just didn't care for the way it turned out. Uh, you know, for one, I think it was a little too long, and for two, the the issue I talked about, I just don't think it would be suitable for a video. <clears throat> I mentioned it in my Halloween Resurrection video that. You know, I talked about that certain thing, but I also mentioned some negative things that I shouldn't have mentioned, like uh, Buster Rhymes was a horrible actor, you know, and they just picked like rap stars like Red Man, which is the main issue I talked about, um, that they should be putting better people in if they want to target, you know, a better, you know, identity. If you want to have, you know, let's just say, a rapper of some kind, put in someone who has some acting ability, you know, put in someone like Omar Epps, put in someone like, of course you can't do Tupac anymore, but, you know, put in someone like that, someone who, you know, and whether or not if they're black or not, but, you know, I think that's really their, their target demographic of what they're trying to do here, you know, maybe put in someone like Samuel L. Jackson or uh, Lawrence Fishburne, you know, and that was kind of the topic I... I had talked about uh, in in the other video, and I mentioned it in my resurrection video that you know I I mentioned this and I was wrong. So I'm just gonna redo the whole seat of Chucky video. I never put it up, so um, I'm just going to kind of keep it here in the archives and just uh, maybe one day down the road I'll put it up and or something. I don't know. But seat of Chucky. I know it's been a couple minutes in, or well, it's been a Almost two minutes in, I haven't talked about it, but there's nothing to say about this movie. Terrible movie. Uh, I like Bride of Chucky, but, you know, this this movie's terrible. Uh, down to the casting, it's just horrible. You got Red Man in here, which, like I said, they should have... If they want to go for that kind of demographic, put somebody in there who can actually act, like Omar Epps, you know, or somebody like that. You know, I haven't seen every movie with a... A rapper in it so I can't comment but some of them are good and some of them are bad uh, Ice Cube might have been another better candidate but I just think Red Man he just doesn't work for this movie okay he's not that funny uh, I mean you know he doesn't really have to do anything you know Jennifer Tilly I don't really hate Jennifer Tilly I know some people can't stand her I don't mind Jennifer Tilly, but the fact that she's playing herself and the fact that she was already in the last movie as, you know, Tiffany before she turned into the doll, it just, it, it makes it kind of inconsistent. It's just ridiculous. The ending, well, I, I, I'm not going to talk about the ending just yet. Uh, then you have Glenn, the, their, their child. And it's it's ridiculous, man. This this thing, it's like it doesn't know if it's a boy or a girl. It just horrible writing. You know, Don Mancini wants to, you know, talk about how oh, well it's Don Mancini and he made fucking uh, Child's Play one, or he helped helped write it. I think he helped do every Child's Play film. And but this one he directed, and and I don't think he directed Child's Play three. But I think somewhere, I heard from somebody that he, you know, was talking shit about Child's Play 3. And I'm like, really? Child's Play 3 is a way better movie than this. You know, um, there's really not much funny about it, to be honest. Uh, there's like maybe one funny scene for me, and that was the Britney Spears thing. I know there's even people that don't like that. You know, but that was like the only funny thing that happened in that movie. Other than that, the movie is just horrible. I definitely not recommend it. I could recommend Bride of Chucky, or I could at least say it's worth one watch, see if you like it or not. But this, I wouldn't recommend anybody watch it. I mean, the only thing you have to take away from this, going into Curse of Chucky, is the fact that, well, Curse of Chucky is, it just references the ending. So you can go on YouTube, watch the ending, and there you go. You're up to speed with what they're going to talk about in Curse of Chucky. Because they do touch on it. But it's just 
there's no real point in watching this movie. Bride of Chucky makes more sense uh, as far as like you know why it was made and everything, but this this is just downright pathetic. You know, there's just no real reason to watch the movie. There's nothing that funny about it. The ending really doesn't make any sense. It's just a terrible, terrible movie. You know, I would not recommend it. Um, because it's just, it's not funny. You know, the other one did a blend of horror and comedy, and it worked. But this movie is just horrible. I can't even go into a scathing rant, you know, like I could maybe with something else, because it's not like I had any expectations for this movie. Nobody asked for this movie. Oh, you had some, like, cliffhanger ending at Bride. Well, whoop de doo You could have done it better. I mean, when you take six years to make this movie, and it still turns out like crap, then there's a problem. So, I'm done talking about this. I definitely wanted to redo this video because I got some information and some... I did a more scathing rant in the other video, but, like I said, most of it was against, you know, a topic I really thought was too sensitive to talk about. Um... It's not really my place to talk about it. And, of course, I said some things like Busta Rhymes was terrible in Resurrection, even though I'd never really seen it. Since I've seen Resurrection, I don't think he's as bad as he's portrayed. Uh, g granted, he could have done better, but, you know, I, I thought he was funny. I know a lot of people don't like Busta Rhymes, but I thought he was okay. So, again, um, there you go. Seed of Chucky, terrible movie. Uh, there's... Nothing I can add, really. It's just a horrible, horrible film. Don't even waste your time. I don't care if it's even... If you're trying to marathon these movies, just skip this one. You're going to be wasting your time. You're not going to get anything out of this. And uh, I'm just going to end it here. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you at Curse of Chucky, where, where you get to hear my opinion on Curse of Chucky, which it's not going to be what you think, so... Again, hopefully you'll stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.